Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. So a bit of a different one this time. So if you remember from my last video, I did some of these nail practice templates and I've done some more. So I wanted to get these out for sort of Valentine's because I've done some of these love ones. So they're actually on Etsy now. So you can get these now. If you go to my shop, there is a link in the description box. And the instructions are on the back. So that's the love one. I've also done a cute one. And I've done a spring one and a summer one. And what you might notice from these is the last ones that I did were really basic ones. And these ones are a little bit more detailed. Um, and I have changed the name. They were um, nail design templates, but I've changed them to um, nails practice templates because these are more for practice really you can use them like i'm going to show you in a minute to do designs with and put them on nails um, but because they're more detailed it means that you can practice with them a lot better so you can practice the basic shapes or you can try and do the finer detail as you get better with your practice so i'm just going to show you um, a couple of examples so I'm just using Madame Glam's gel polish. So I'm using this these from the Amor Tints collection. So that's the like sort of February Valentine's collection. And I'm using this, um, it's like an abstract heart, this one. So it's like a heart shape, but it's just squiggly lines. So this one, you can do it any way you want. You don't have to do it exactly as the template is. You can do it your own style within that heart shape. So I'm using a couple of colours from that collection. And I'm just using the Madame Glam top coat. It's not the no white top coat. It's the wiping top coat because that's still got a tacky layer on it. And I find that works a bit better. So I'm putting that on and curing it for 30 seconds. And then I'm going in with my colour. So I'm using this glittery one. And then I'm just painting over those lines. So like I said, they don't have to be perfect. As long as it's like an abstract sort of heart shape, then that's what I'm going for. So when I'm happy with that, I cure that in the lamp for 60 seconds. So that's completely cured. And then I just take it off the template. And I did give myself a bit of an extra sort of long bit with the top coat at the bottom. And that helps me just take the template off. And then what I do when I'm happy with that and I've took it off is I just cut off the excess bits that I don't want. And then I can just place it on the nail with the tweezers. And this nail has got um, a sticky base coat on it. Your base coats for pigments and things like that would work really well with this because they do have a stronger sort of stick. So then the next design that I'm doing is these lips. So. I'm going to use the perfect black first and I'm going to outline those lips and I'm going to then go over with the colour when I'm happy with it. So when I've done the outline, I'm curing that um, for 60 seconds you can fl flash cure it in between for like 10 seconds so that you don't lose your design and then when I'm when I've cured it fully I'm just going to wipe off the dispersion layer and um, with some alcohol and that just means that the black coloring isn't going to get into my pink when I put that over the top so yeah I just go over the top of the pink and it doesn't matter that I'm painting over the lines because that's going to be the underside that you can see me painting on the design is going to be reversed when I take it off the sheet and I'll turn it round and then stick it the other way but I just do just cut that extra bit off before I do that so then yeah I just place it on with my tweezers pressing it down and then when I'm happy with where it is I'm going to get the top coat again and I'm just going to go over with the top coat and then give that a 60 second cure so these, as with my other templates, they are available as a digital download. So you can print that off as an A4 sheet or you can have them printed off by me as four A6 sheets and they will be delivered to you all laminated and everything in a little Ziploc pouch with a thank you note. And they are the size that fits into your UV lamp. So it's totally up to you, the type that you want to get. 
So I'm just going to do one last one now. So I'm using this Love's Veil and that's also from Madame Glam's latest collection. And I'm just going to cure that. And then I'm going to put the sticky layer over the top, the sticky base gel, but I'm not going to do that on camera. So for this one, I'm doing it a little bit differently. Instead of using the detailer brush, I'm just using a very small dotting tool just to do these hearts because they are super small. And I just wanted to show you that you can do really fine detail. It doesn't have to be, you know, the bigger designs. You can do smaller ones, although it is, it is more difficult to do the very small images. So I'm just using my little scraper tool there just to get under that image and just lift it away and then I'm using my tweezers just to take it off and then I'll hold it in the tweezers while I just take the end off that I don't need and then I will just press it down onto the nail where I want it and then I'll just give that one a top coat as well. So there will be links to everything that I've used in today's video in the description box as usual and I hope you like this video. If you did, uh, please give me a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already um, and those of you that have subscribed, I want to say a big thank you because I've reached 5,000 subscribers now so thank you so much to everyone for that. Um, yeah, so like I said earlier, everything will be in the description box for you and yeah, thank you so much for watching this one and I'll see you next time. Bye!